Hello, and welcome back to Let's Play Baldur's Gate 2 Enhanced Edition with me, Bring It On. So let's talk to Unger Hildark. If you wish. Right, what are you staring at? Ain't illegal to be a dwarf last I heard. Take your eyes off me and put them someplace safe. Okay, uh, Jolia told us not to make him angry. I'm gonna go with option two. Uh, no need for hostilities. Jolia sent me. I wish to discuss a lithium. She did, did she? I have to have a chat with the lass. I trust you paid her enough that there will be some for her to split with me. She'll see that it is wise to do so. You seek a lithium, do you? I have none, and I won't be getting any getting any anytime soon. Now that that is out of the way, goodbye. Uh, wait. This could be very profitable for you. Won't you reconsider? It doesn't matter, fool. I don't have any lithium. It's that simple. My source is inaccessible, and you aren't getting any. Get angry if you wish, but it won't help. You sound like this was not a planned shortage. What is the problem? Oh, so now you wish to be my friend. Why should I bother with you at all? You can't fix your problem or you would have a lithium. What else can you do? Nothing. Very few opportunities for mercantile trade in this place when you're even a hill or mountain dwarf. Alright, fool. You wish to share my problem? I'll give it to you. You want a lithium, you can wait for it. We mine it deep in the earth, and it's dangerous going. It's rare enough when production is normal. This is all useless information though, because my latest shipment was stolen from under me. So there's no lithium for anyone for another season or more. Uh, maybe I should try to have a talk with the person that robbed you. You want to go chasing after him? That's your business. It's lost to me anyway. I show my face, and I'll have the guards on me just for being Dorogar. Typical of this city. I'm just a poor businessman, uh, but I'll be jailed just for my shadowed face. This bastard that robbed me looks like a rock gnome, so he's welcomed with open arms. They wouldn't guess at what a fiend he is. After I hired him, I found out what he had done. I suppose that's why he cheated me and took off. Don't you worry, just point me in the right direction. Yes, well, you can go after him if you like. Last I heard, he was holed up in the bridge district. A derelict little, a derelict little place bought with my gold. Here, I even mark it on your map there. He won't be moving much. He was on the run from Baldur's Gate when I met him. Oh, I suppose you'll want his name as well. The name was Neb. He left a few families crying, or so I hear. Tell his corpse that Unger Hildark sent you. So, I think Neb... I don't remember. Uh, he's one of the characters, I think, that is related to someone from Baldur's Gate 1, or is from Baldur's Gate 1. Why must we always be fighting? All I see is bloodshed and battle, and it drains me. Oh, do, you, do you not yearn for a life of peace and contemplation? Uh, sometimes battle is required, Airy. It's not something that I have a choice about. None of us have ever had a choice, I suppose. But I see no good that comes out of fighting and constant struggle. Um, uh, yeah, I guess number one. Uh, fighting has brought me strength, Airy. The strength to survive. You could use the same. Strength. Always you talk of strength and being stronger. I... I don't know if I have your strength, Donald. I'm beginning to think it is almost not worth it. Yeah, well, too bad. I'm going to replace you anyway. She talks so much. She interrupts. I guess all I have left to do is go back to the bridge district. I kind of want to go to the gates first. And knock this out. Because it's a very small area. It is done. Hey, Flidian. What you want? Oh, hello. Can I help you? Actually, hmm. Perhaps you can help me. Help you? Who are you and what do you mean? I'm a messenger sent by a high merchant of trade meat to find someone to help our town. You look like adventurers. It might be just the sort of help we need. And who is this High Merchant? He is Lord Logan Copperith, Mayor and High Merchant of Trade Meat. He's willing to offer a substantial reward for anyone who can help tra Trade Meat out of its difficulties. Uh, what is it worth? I need to save up enough coin to rescue your friend from being held by the Cowed Wizards. I'm not sure how much it is, but it'll be a large one. Lord Logan is wealthy and desperate for some help, you see. And where is this town? Here, I can show you on your map. Do you think you might be able to help us? 
Uh, sure, yes, I think I can. I've been known to deal with such things in the past. I have no idea what I'm doing. I forgot to ask what, uh... I thought the town thing wouldn't lead to the end of the conversation, that I'd be able to go back and ask what they needed. Uh, excellent. I'll send word to L Lord Logan to expect you. Thank you for your assistance. It cannot be. I'd sooner tear out my own... Tear out my eyes than strike down innocent animals. Well, perhaps only one eye. But not, do not think me any less incensed. Alright, this should tell me what it is. I do remember trade meat, but I don't remember... Try and help trade meat, which is southeast of Alcala. They're suffering from a strange animal-based siege, and the local druids are sus suspected. High Merchant Lord Logan Coperth may have infor information for me. Alright. So they might not be innocent animals, Minsk. That's okay. Declare yourself. Hold, Traveler. What is your business here in Othkatla? I'm a simple merchant. I deal in spices and silks. Spices. Is that a fact? Stand and deliver whilst I search you. Now really, there's no cause for that. I think there is. Here then. Is this some of your spices? Why yes, yes, they are. Then if you were to think them suspect, would a few gold and sample turn your eye? A few gold, you say? Hmm. I don't know. I think you find my spices well worth it. It is especially difficult to acquire lotus petals of such a dark hue. Almost black. You've a deal. On your way then. Thank you very much, good sir. Black lotus, huh? Nope, no one actually. You know what? Yeah, we'll. Alright. If you wish. Shahira, what do you have on? I forgot what I gave her. Oh, it's this. So I remember why she has that aura around her. Like, I didn't buy her the, uh... I can extend you my hand, though I'll have to wash it after. The Sensate amulet. Alright, uh, they're breaking up. Tell your neighbors. Uh, Lava and Tiro. It finally happened. Uh, what are you yelling about, sir? Who are Alava and Tiro? Uh, you're not from here if you're not excited by my words. Disregard them if they mean nothing to you. I'll tell those that do care. I'll listen intently if you will tell. It's not something that should concern an outsider. You're not one of those nosy adventuring types, are you? Don't you go meddling. We don't need any strangers going near those two. The best thing for their families is if they stop seeing each other. The families are conspiring to keep them apart? Why? You don't know anything about it, and I suggest you keep it that way. We don't want to draw attention to this. You'd be ashamed to involve the guards in this. They're good kids, just misguided. You stay out of it. Yes. I hope our establishment's to your liking. If you need an ale or whatnot, you have to get it from Grand Canner at the bar. It's a silly name. Our patrons serve themselves. I don't require anyone to wait upon me. I serve myself like the rest when I buy. You'll fit right in then. We share everyone equally in here, mostly because they are. The nobles stay in the city. This is one sorry excuse for a bar, I tell you. Cut a man off after five or six, just because he's out of coin. <laughs> what? What is she staring at? Never seen a man, uh, before? You look like a man of the world. What's going on around here? Going on? Nothing at all. This here is the outskirts of Athkatla, so nothing real important goes on. Well, not unless you count Tiro and Alava. Fighting lots lately. Local celebrities, really. Yes, sir. And a soul in this place that ain't watching them. Best you leave them alone, though. Let nature do its work on them. Yep. Used to, used to be nice kids. Don't know what, what went wrong. Excuse me. Alright, Ron Canner, let's talk to you, then we'll go through that secret door. 
I got me some nice looking waitresses, don't I? <laughs> I like how they make all the bartenders perverts. Uh, how's my new friend there? Uh, smile and stay a day or two. You got coin, you'll always be welcome. Oh, excuse me. I thought I had something in my throat. I didn't want to cough. Uh, not the fanciest lodging, but I'll lay a blanket in the stables for you if you need. It's more comfortable than it sounds. You offer your stables for, to people to sleep in. Is that healthy? Have you ever heard of a horse being called healthy as a hardy human? No, I didn't think so. They keep just fine, and so would you. It's all the same to you. I'll pass on that offer for now. See yourself. The door is always open if need be. Uh, can you tell me anything about Alava and Tiro? That isn't your affair. Suffice to say that they aren't welcome in here while they are together. Leave it be. They don't concern you. I got some cheap beer for you. All right. Let's see what he has. Doesn't have. Okay. If you wish. Locked, you say? Well. I can dance on the head of a pin as well. Oh. My friend here might have something else to say about that. Long have I rested in the halls below the old city. Long have I been at peace. Your disturbance shall not go unpunished. Okay, I forgot. Wait. Is this? I think this is part of Kengax's quest, right? You shall suffer my wrath. Holy crap! A rolling. Yeah, yeah. All right, Ari, we need to protect from. I'll do it. Great fun. Hey. Evil. Right. Do we have? Protection from evil up. Where is he at? Oh, she should have slow somewhere. Where is slow? I'll try slowing him. Actually, dispel magic might be better here. And I think I do the same thing with Jahira. She should have dispel magic as well. And it is a lich. I'm going to use an oil of speed. Ah, oh, time stop. What a jerk. Yeah, liches are no joke in this game. I mean, they're not really a joke in any game, so... Um, I don't think we're going to come out on top here, but we'll try. So I also should have probably cast an Insect Swarm first. Don't think he's going to make it. Also, she got interrupted from casting. Hmm. Yeah, I should have buffed up before I came in here. It hurts so much. Oh, I can't access this inventory. What is he affected by? What is that? May oh, maze? Son of a gun. Okay, we're gonna reload here. Uh, if we're gonna fight a lich, we need to definitely buff up. Alright, so we start with this. It's not gonna help out a lot in this fight, but it's better than nothing. Nature servant everyone has access to it. All right, then we'll do bless with Jahira, chant with Eri, protection from evil with Animan. 
Oh wait, I should also be casting uh, that on myself, and he should also have, yeah, same thing for himself. What else do we have? Uh, let's see. I'm gonna do aid as well. Apply righteous magic. Yeah, we're going all out here for you know obvious reasons. She has another casting of aid, which we'll give to. Oh wait, no, sorry, wrong one. To Minsk, because he has his own aid he can cast. Ready, I think. So first thing I need to do when I go in there is to cast Insect Plague. Hopefully, it hits him before he uh, gets out of control. Drop on Holy Might. He has Righteous Magic. We should be good to go. We'll try. Alright, I'm gonna try and hit him with a magic missile first thing to try and stall his uh, casts. Hopefully that gives her enough time to hit him with Insect Plague. What? Nope, it was not enough, but we can still try to hit him with Dispel Magic. Nonetheless, though I don't think it's actually going to do anything. If we had Keldor in this would be much easier. Also, he does do a bunch of fire damage. I should probably use a... Uh... Actually, I should probably have that going as well. Uh, he would do fine with this casted on himself. And he could probably do with better arrows than what he's using. Use those. Alright, he did cast stop time. That's frustrating. I wonder if he's going to cast the same spells. Protected from evil, yeah. Meteor Swarm is also the same, so Gate Lich is going to be the next one. We'll have to take out the Fit Fiend first. Since I can actually target the Fit Fiend. You run the pit fiend? My weapon does nothing. Not works. Should probably have summons up as well. I don't know how much good they're gonna do right now. Who has our potions? All right, we'll split these into two. We'll split them up like that. That to him. Where Minsk goes, evil stands hmm. inside. I don't know if we can actually do this or not. Yeah, we are getting completely annihilated here. I'm gonna need more fire resist. Uh, I have those potions I could probably take before we came in here as well. Which might be what we have to do. I think he actually has. He has a potion of fire resist. That'll come in handy. I like how Yoshimo isn't getting hit by anything, he's just chilling back there. Alright, um... Oh, she's got rigid thinking on, so that's not going to do us any favors. Alright, what do we have here? We can still cast slow, where is it at? There it is. Oh, Animan... 
Oh, I'm mazed, that's right. I'll help however I can. Uh, let's see. Maybe we can summon a skeleton. I don't think it's gonna be a lot of good here, but better than nothing. Let's go ahead and summon uh the spider as well. And then where's our healing at? What can I do? Alright, what else do we have? Let's uh I was taking damage from Yoshimo, so that's good. Yeah, magic missile's working. Get a Mary. No effect? That's not right. Chain contingency, spell turning, and mislead. Oh boy. What did he cast? Invisible. Alright, if I had control over Jahira, that wouldn't be a problem. Alright, we cast another slow, so let's do that. It'll help out a little bit at least. Oop, wrong key. Should I keep him healthy? Go for the eyes, yeah! Sorry, can't use that on him. Uh, what else do we got? Oh, Oracle. Uh, he summoned his own skeleton warrior. I'll have mine fight. Oh no, he isn't a 3D. Never mind. Alright, that rigid thinking is lasting way too long. Hey, I'm back. Finally. I just lay on hands her, try to keep her alive. This fight has taken a lot longer than I thought it was going to. Actually, let's give Minsk a potion of speed as well. I hit to no effect. I hit to no effect. Great fun! Then I want to give that back to my paladin, of course. Uh, let's see, what else do we got? Oh, we're just gonna do mask here. Why not? Because we do have some some companions that are a little banged up. Oh, he needs to heal himself. Right, we've almost got him. There we go. Sucker. Hmm. Alright, we did it. I mean they're they're not doing so hot, but uh You need something? There we go. All right. I can dance on the head of a pin as well. I'm gonna assume that this is trapped, but it might not be. I think I'll wait until their uh, rigid thinking wears off. It is rigid thinking, right? Oh, stun. Fleet of foot and all that. All right, also, Othkala does have a big uh, lich problem. This is not the only lich that's in Othkala. A longsword that I do not recognize. Give it to him for now. All right. It is done. There you have it. As I thought. Simple. 
Oh, none of these chests can be interacted with. Crazy. Alright, let's get involved in someone else's business. So, Lava, that's it then? Tiro, I... I guess so. Nobody wants us together. I guess we shouldn't be. That's what my family says too. I didn't think we did that bad. A few scraps here and there. It was fun, while it lasted. I guess I have to settle down though. Yeah, Father said he can't keep it quiet any longer. I don't know what the fuss is about though. It's not like it's their lives. I guess they're embarrassed. Yeah, I guess. Hey, looks like we have an audience. Hey you, get a portrait painted. It lasts longer. I'm Donald. I heard about your family's trying to split you two up. Word certainly gets around. Hear that, Alava? We're famous. Uh, your father couldn't keep it totally quiet. I like that. I feel important. It is kind of interesting. What did you hear, stranger? What are they saying? It sounded like they were embarrassed that you two were together. That's one word for it. Embarrassed, horrified, outright angry. They don't like the way we act when we're together. They say we'll just end up in trouble, and they won't be able to help. Not like they've been helped so far. They just had guards following us, making sure we don't do anything wrong. Can't watch us all the time though, hmm? We slipped away for a bit. Oh man, Maunu's barn was never the same. <laughs> oh, hush up you. You know we're not supposed to talk about that. Father kept it quiet. Maybe I don't want to be quiet. How about you, stranger? Should I be quiet? Like, I think, I think this quest ends up being a lesson in minding your own business. Yeah, it sounds like your families think you're not the best influence on each other. Well, that's true enough. But what do they know? It's not their lives. I know, I know. But are we ready to go it alone? I mean, your father's kept what we do quiet. I know. I'm not sure. Yeah, if you don't think you're ready, then that's your answer. Not my business, though. I do believe that. If you think you're not ready for something, as far as, like, family goes, that's fine. Uh, sometimes, in other circumstances, even if you feel like you're not ready, like for a test or something, something a little more mundane, then go for it. You, I mean, sometimes you don't have a choice anyway, but, like, as far as family goes, like having kids and stuff, if you feel like you're not ready, don't do it. That's right. None of your business. Get lost. Yeah. I hate to have to hurt you or something. Yeah, tell him. Then we should... No. No, it's over. Goodbye, Tiro. See you... sometime? Maybe. Sometime. I feel like if you told them if to stay wish. together, I think you end up finding them... dead later on? I don't know. I remember the game that well. I'm assuming that's what's gonna happen. Alright! Well, good job, everybody. We killed a lich. Uh, let's actually go get all that stuff identified. If you wish. You must gather your party before venturing forth. And then in the next episode, we can do the. Uh, you must gather your party before venturing forth. The bridge district, because we have a lot of stuff to do there. What did I give it to? Oh, him. Oh, Daystar. Oh, actually, that's that's very good. Daystar is very good against undead, and I'm glad that I have that now, because that'll help against uh, the other liches that we have to kill. Alright, so Sunblade, Daystar. Whether created specifically for use in the service of Torm, or appropriated at some point in the long history of the church, Paladins of the Loyal Fury have made good use of Daystar in their battles against evil undead. Uh, through magic or blessing, it is empowered with the Sunray, a force of pure life energy so potent that it slays both living and unliving. So you use Sunray once per day, uh, damage 3 to 6, save versus spell, or be blinded for one turn. Undead, an additional 1 to 6 points of damage per caster level, or per ca level of caster. And it's plus 2, but plus 4 versus evil creatures, and same with damage. So, very, very good. Alright, that's where we had um, all this stuff to identify as well. Alright, let's go through her stuff. What all did she get? Oh yeah, she also has to memorize that spell. All 
Alright, another wand of magic missiles, another wand of fire. Rod of terror, we'll get to that in a second. Wand of lightning, which I'll probably never use. Wand of cloud kill. And the sand thief's ring. Ring of invisibility, sand thief's ring. Held by a master thief for the better part of a generation, this ring was put to bold use in the markets of Waterdeep. Working a crowd in broad daylight, the rogue would steal countless numbers of purses from nobles, replacing them with bags of sand so the theft would go unnoticed. His identity was never known, but the name Sand Thief was cursed loudly in its stead. It is rumored he retired, and now lives among the nobles he used to rob. It's invisibility once per day, I guess we can give that to him, since he doesn't have another ring on. And then... Let's actually get all these potions back on his person. It's a longsword, right? Yeah. So that might be better than this. The silent. Oh man, I should have used that. If I used that early on, that probably would have been... Well, save versus spell. He probably would have been, um... Resistant to it. The Lich. Alright, Rod of Terror. When activated, this rod may be used as a staff plus three. Any creature hit by the rod must make a saving throw versus spell or flee in terror. Uh, fearing the wielder as if he or she were a flesh-eating demon from the abyss. There's a drawback to using this rod, however. Each time the rod is used, there's a 20% chance the wielder loses one point of charisma permanently. Yeah, um, I'm gonna say that's not worth it. Yeah, yeah. Hmm. So yeah, it took me a little longer to explore the uh, the gate area than I uh, was anticipating. But well, that's okay, we killed a lich, which is, you know, no small feat in of itself. Especially since I forgot that it was there. Something I'm forgetting. Oh yeah, I want to sell the Rod of Terror, don't plan on using that. It is done. Okay, uh, let's go ahead and heal up a little bit. Good rest. I'm pretty sure I don't have any timed quests currently. You must gather your oh, party well. before venturing forth. Come on, let's kill something now. <laughs> All right. Simple. In the next episode, we will head towards the bridge district. And deal with all the stuff that we have to do there. There is... I'm pretty sure all the quests that we have that aren't outside the city. Yeah, so a friend of Quails is in the bridge district. Uh, well, that's in the temple district. Uh, Sarles' quest is in the uh, bridge district. Uh, this is in the bridge district for the fallen paladins. Dank pool of base corruption, if ever there was one. If not for the order, the gods would surely smite man for such sins. Kidnappers of Bird Tear Deer, or Turder, is also there. Um, I think part of this quest is there. Yeah. A lot of stuff to do. Anyway. Gonna call it here, and in the next episode, we will, uh, yeah, go to the bridge district finally. Huzzah! Anyway, thanks for watching. Hope to see you guys in the next episode.